What's happening? Welcome back to another video. Excuse the not shaving look. Um, I can't be bothered. I actually can't be bothered with a lot of things recently, like getting up in the morning. I've been trying to like meditate a lot more and I got on like an 11 day streak and then I just stopped. So that needs improving, but hey, it's a new day. Let's get the day started. Let's get a nice little cup of tea into me and hit up training. Here, you know it's the um, shortest day of the year, guys. Today? Yeah. Thank goodness. Brad? Yes, mate. trying to work out all of my techniques on floor. Should I do forward twisting from a handspring or my double fronts from a handspring or should I just do it from a run? I'm really not sure. I guess that's just the lack of numbers being highlighted um, throughout the past couple of years where I haven't been doing floor. But now is the opportunity to figure those things out. But it's annoying, still. So today I'm not gonna focus on handspring work. I'm gonna focus on just the run into the somersaults. Um, Let's see how that goes. Maybe we just need to run more and then. Yeah, but like, but then if you do like a half of the way around, but I know what you mean, you just need to go to choose. Yeah, true. Sure. So we're doing this thing on pommel where we're doing A to G into handstand dismount. An A valued skill is the easiest skill and a G valued skill or an H actually. How do H handstand dismount? That would make sense. That's the most difficult skill. So we're going to work our way up through the alphabet into a dismount after each skill. Matthew, what's a C valued skill? Oh, that's so boring. What about a back to your handstand? Just back to your handstand, it is. record. <laughs> I'm 
back home in the middle of the week for a bit of a change. I've just been busy the past couple of weekends at award evenings and doing interviews and stuff like that. So I haven't really been spending enough time at home seeing the dog, or seeing the family, seeing the girlfriend. So an extra night up home is quite nice. I'll be going straight back down to Dublin tomorrow. But on tonight's agenda, we are going to go and see the new Avatar movie. I bet you wish you were coming, Finn. Do you? Do you? No, he's happy enough chilling here, aren't you? So yeah, it's sometimes annoying driving back home for like a three hour drive, especially when you hit that rush hour traffic around Christmas time. It's most certainly three hours to Dublin. And then as well, fuel prices rising. I spent a lot of money on fuel. <laughs> but it is certainly worth it for that extra even evening with um, my girlfriend or with family. And I just gotta count my blessings that I'm actually able to do that, that I'm actually able to shut up the road for an evening or whatever, rather than being, you know, I, I could be in a different country or anything, so yeah, gotta be grateful and take the positives. No, in the last video, you guys asked for it, and here it is, the metal, I charged it. There's a little charging port at the top of the metal there, and it lights up around the outside of the metal, which is pretty gnarly. And the ribbon also lights up, which is very, very cool. So I'll actually turn the light off here. Now you can see nothing but the metal. <laughs> but the ribbon lights up too. And that's the medal from 2019 World Championships when I won bronze. So that will do for this video. I don't think I'll make another video until after Christmas. So I hope everyone has a great Christmas. Enjoy the time spent with family or friends and enjoy your time off work if you have any. I will sign out in this video by leaving you a pretty cool little montage video. It was done for the RTE Awards um, by Elaine Buckley and it's just a cool little montage showing me climbing up a mountain, falling a bunch of times on the way up and finally reaching the summit and it's meant to be a metaphor for that journey in my gymnastics career to reach that world championship status. So I hope you enjoy, hope you have a happy Christmas and I'll catch you in the next video. Oh no! It didn't go my way today. Oh my goodness. How unfortunate for Reese. My finger got caught under the handle. That's it. The apparatus of precision and peril. It's not my best gymnastics, but I know that there's more to come. The beauty of gymnastics is that it comes down to one routine. He's got his game face on. And I'm ready to show the world what I'm capable of. He's such an artist on the panels. I feel solid, I feel relaxed. This is a very good exercise from Reese. I know that if I just hit this dismount, this could win. And lands it perfectly. My feet hit the floor and I feel relief. I pulled it off when it mattered on the biggest stage. I made history for my country. Ireland's first world gymnastics champion. To go through hardship, to come back and finally be on top of the world, the lifelong dream come true. Champion, Reese McClanagan!